Alright, welcome back to Normandy. Uh, just when we thought our war was over, um, after the Epsom campaign, we have been sequestered into a squadron of P-51 Mustangs. And we are going to continue on uh, in this war, uh, pretty much straight after the Epsom campaign. Uh, and we're going to go on to Operation Sharnwood. Now, Operation Sharm was another campaign that was built by, um, well, briefing and preparation-wise by Bunyip. So, very familiar with all the briefing cards and setup. Um, now, Epson campaign finished the 29th or 30th of June. So, this is uh, a few days afterwards. Uh, so, July 1944. So, basically, Operation Epson was the push out of the beachhead um, onto Khan and I was in support of that and now Operation Sharnwood is the final push into Khan so members of the British and Canadian divisions 3rd, 59th, uh, 43rd division and 3rd Canadian will be pushing onto Khan and I'll be in support of that offensive uh, we've got the uh, several SS uh, Panzer divisions uh, protecting the Khan and yeah my mission is basically support that push um, specifically today I have a bombing target straight away looking at the brief of this campaign it looks like I'll be doing a lot more um, bombing orientated missions so for better or worse um, I'm not in this squadron for my uh, prowess in the last campaign, and more so the fact I just survived. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so today we've got a strike which is only 12 miles from base, uh, incidentally, which is Rookville, I'm going with, at the advanced landing ground B7. And I'm just going to fly out uh, 12 miles at 146 degrees and hit this uh, bridge um, here we go that's the target area so I'll be flying in from the north anyone who watched my last campaign uh, would uh, recognize this little crescent little area here because I had a little bombing mission just after that so I'm pretty confident of getting on the right area um, and yeah basically it's just in front of this main town uh, past the fork in the river uh, there's the actual bridge itself. This is flipped around now, so I'll be coming in from the top here. So I think I'll come in from this direction and just hit it from the um, northwest, flying like that. Uh, the other flights, uh, incidentally, I'm still part of the A third group, uh, Kenway. Um, they'll be my top hat still. So it's all very familiar. Uh, it's basically just a sequel to the last campaign. Uh, except I'm in P-51s, which is a nice change. So I say we jump in and let's go. And pause. Now I just need uh, to figure out how to start properly. <laughs> I did a quick uh, crash course. Uh, they gave me a crash course after I forgot how many Spitfire and a couple of days worth. And yeah, I'm sure I'll be able to fly this thing. What can go wrong? Let's whack the battery on, generator. Uh, let's go from left to right, so let's put flaps up, ram air, forward, uh, let's go fuel on, main tank's already on, magnetos to both, prop pitch forward, throttle one inch forward, Parking brake on. Call in ATC. Colt, one time lead in to head on. Airborne with four Mustangs and proceeding to the target. Do you have anything new for us? Tonic up there, taken off. Um, oxygen. Oxygen is blinking, so I'm assuming that's working. And what do we got here? Gun heats. P 
Okay, they, I'll leave those off for now. Just checking everything. Um, I think I'm good to start. So I go primer for about three to four seconds. And start. Oh, boost. Boost, boost, boost. Oh. Hopefully that didn't muck it up. Yeah, boost first. Anyway, good start. Two started, excellent. It's a nice looking airfield. Uh, now the temps are going from memory. We have 40 degrees I want to run up to minimum. Is that 40? Yeah, about 40 there I think it is. Uh, coolant run between, yeah it's nice, it's got the green and the red, you can't really go wrong can you? Carb temp, I think is about 15, you want to warm it up to. Um, I did look at the, let's have a look at that, that Chuck's guide of the running temps. Uh, so manifold pressure, I don't keep around this one, I usually run just under, rather than push it too hard initially, uh, so I'm going to keep it around 40 and 2400, so basically just above the green on this one, and um, that one on the manifold, and watch my temperatures, uh, which are, like I said, in the green here, 100 to 110, 70 to 80. All the oil, 70, 80 psi. That's the oil pressure, which is which one's pressure? This one, which is high at the moment. Not sure if that's just because I'm on the ground. And 16, 18 is the fuel pressure. All right, so let's a quick look at the. Kneeboard. What was it? One four six. Uh, any timings on this? Uh, five thirty. Five thirty-five takeoff. All right. So I'm all squared away to take off. Uh, oops. What am I doing? ATC. That's where I did that. Oops, the radio one would be good. Colt 1 1, request startup. Uh, let's put the pedo heat on, I guess. Can heat. Clear for startup. Wind 075. Colt 1 1, request taxi to runway. Now, yeah, rudder, we want about 5 to 6. Yeah, I think I'll run about 2 degrees nose down. I'm pretty happy with the temp, so let's push on. Gun sight. Alright, let's do it. Whoa, brakes, brakes, brakes. Yeah, let's just request Cold. take off. One, one. Request take off. Who's follow me out, and we are good to go. Let's close the canopy. I think it's rolling a bit too far, if that's okay. Alright, so gonna aim for about 50 down the runway here. Ease the nose forward. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oof. Oof. Oh boy, gear up. Oof. 
soon as I put that nose down, it pulled me right like a uh, like you know what. <laughs> uh, I'll have to practice that one. That's for sure. Maybe not as much rudder right trim. All right, um, let's get squared away. Uh, radio. How's our temps? Temps are good. So that's uh, four taken off, so. So I start climbing for a little bit and I'll come back uh, when I'm pushing on to the target, which I do believe. That's Khan. It's going to be just off that direction. Alright, I'll come back when I'm pushing on the target. Oof. Actually, before I leave you, that oil temperature is climbing scarily. Um, now I've got these over here that are on automatic and I did read if they're getting too high to switch to the manual so we just open open there's the oil that's rising so there you go you can see it dropping is okay so I don't know if I trust that automated feature Let's just keep that on automatic that is okay yeah the oil temperature is back down that was interesting yeah I'm not, I'm not too familiar with the um, engine operation so I just like to be a bit over paranoid early on um, these are general smokes this one looks like something's been hit something's gone down uh, what's my height 3000 I've got to climb to 8 might just circle for a little bit more Get my scalp a bit, I think. Crystal needed to complete it. A bridge to the north of yours is destroyed, but is well defended. Watch for Frank at low level of so human release. Cult, cult's me, I'm cult leader. Watch for Flack, low level, your bridge didn't destroy north of mine. Watch for Flack at low level. Thanks for the head drop. Oh, okay, that's, that's the bridge he's talking about, I think, because that's the one river there. And my target, let's see if I can see that crest in the river. So let's just figure out where I am first. I think I've gone too far to the west. Uh, check my temps again. Oh, no, cool, it's getting up now. Cool, it's getting up. Open, open, open. Now it's dropping. Okay, so whoever organised or set up this auto auto um, radar to control and all um, we call it all controls. Uh, they need to do a bit more work, I think, <laughs> or I'm not doing the plane properly. But everything looks like it's in the green now, so. Uh, let's have a look. I might as well keep this uh, camera rolling. So I'm not that far off, I don't think. Where is this crescent section? Let's have a look at the knee board. Oh, 
All right, so this is the fork in the river, I think. You'll see one river this way, one river that way. And I think that was the Crescent section. Yeah, because this is the bit I bombed in the last campaign. So that makes my bridge just north of this town. Somewhere in this section. Uh, what's my height? Uh, 5,000, still can't get up. Taps are too low now. Push it up, I think, to about 45. Don't want to freeze them either. So let's close the touch. They're bloody fussy. Um, what do I see now? Can't see anything. There's that little strip of a town down here, which is where that one on the southeast, if I can move my mouse there. So I'm doing this all one handed while I fly. Actually, I can keep that up, can't I? So that's that town I'm flying over now. Alright, there's the fork. Tally. That's the bridge. Heavy flak west of Khan. Super, that's where I'm headed. Oh, hang on, hello. Let's get these bombs set up before I get shot. drop one at a time. The question is, is that both bombs? Training bombs? Pretty sure in the training mission I did, I had it on train. And that dropped one at a time, but why is it called train for? Well, we'll soon find out. Uh, what else do I need to do? Instant arm um, I need to do... There we go. Alright, where's this? There's the bridge there. Oh, how's this flat going? I'm just shy of 8,000. That's going to have to do... Alright, let's head in now. Oh, oh. oh, oh mine's all out again. Oh boy. And flex coming up. There we go. Come, come right and release some out of it. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Oh, just missed. Just missed. Uh, let's get my wing to attack. Oof. Not too bad. Did that drop both wings? No, I've got one more. Excellent. Give that another go. Alright, so train means one. I was on the training mission, <laughs> the thing, I wasn't sure, but it did blow up in the training mission, so... Yeah. Uh, okay, three's running in. I might not even need to drop it. Oh, there's another target down over there. Must be another target. So they keep jinking. Bombs away. Four, 
Oops. Oh boy, can't keep it straight here. Oof. Pretty sure that's a that's it. Uh, let's just dodge some of this flak. That's really worrying me. Oh, I've got my other flight back there too, I've just realised. Get some height right now. Uh, check my temps. Temps are too cold still. This is okay. So I'm cold, so he's going in the bridge. Hit. Alright, so let's get flight rejoin. Flight, join up. Oh jeez. See that tracer? Oh boy. So Tonic's going back to base, he's done his Oh, I can't believe how close that tracer was. down to that village. Uh, it's not my it's not my thing to go against that like like the last campaign. Let's keep weaving. Alright so we're heading one nine five twenty on the floors. A bit. So I think I just follow the Orange River down the flows. Contact target, that's a ground vehicle. So flight, gauge, utility. It's not air target, he's talking about oh, air defense. There we go. going off over there, so that must be them. That's Enfield 2, so how about we get them in the action? Gauge ground targets. Gauge ground targets. Alright, so that's Enfield 2 there. My flight's guns. Question is, where the heck are they? Getting rid of this bomb myself. Yeah, I just don't know where they are. I know where the flak is, it's right on me. Oh, that shadows. Smoking planes are easy to spot, smoking vehicles. I'm like I can't even see where these flackies shooting up from. Oh that's getting close. Let's go this way. Oh, tally. Oh, okay. Uh, 
Chris needs to wire a wrist trying to bomb that RD position. See it right here. Being a coward, not going for it. I think I'm playing smart. It's not my mission to bomb AA guns. Well, I might kill one of my flight. It's my height, 10, 11,000 almost. Okay, I'm going to do a very high bombing run on him. Uh, I'm going to have the cloud in the way. Set up. Lost their position now, I can't see them. I think it's there. There they are. And oh boy. And release. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Don't black out. Uh, I missed by a mile, didn't I? Yep. Bugger. Yeah. I was no idea it. Oh boy, oh boy. Ouch, 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 ouch. I think that hit me. Oh, come on. Get out of here. Oh, they're not happy with me. Temperatures. Cold still. Close, close, close. Get that old temperature up. Gonna have to bind those thing those I think. So joystick. Um okay, I survived. Oh so let these guys keep bombing. Or keep strafing. No holes in the wings, so maybe I did escape that. They're hitting another target right now that I can't see. There's my fuel. Quarters there, full tank there, okay. It's not bad. Temperature's still too low, how about we put that up to auto now? See if it holds it. So there's the Orn River off on my left, I'm gonna keep pushing out a bit. I have no idea what they're hitting, but they are cleaning up. Oh, be careful, they still flack out here. Seems to be far away from me as well. Maybe they're close by my other flight. There they are down there. Green, gun, gun. Green, 
Alright, three, you'll get the medal. And two, you're all getting medals. Looks like Enfield 2's rejoined me, so I'll just make sure of it. Okay, that oil temperature's going back up. Keep an eye on it. And I'll just keep following this oil river. Gosh, how many targets are down there? Okay, I have to keep circling. I'll come back when they've finished their bombing and I'm pushing on the next waypoint. Because these guys just don't seem to be quitting. Okay, welcome back. Um, I do believe I have Fleurs off my left wing. I'm familiar with from the previous campaign, so that's my turning point. I don't think I've lost any uh, flight mail. Oh, some flex coming up. So, unless I see some ground targets, I'm just going uh, to keep my distance and do an orbit around there. Um, let's keep an eye out. No flat guns going off, which is a good sign. Check those temps. Uh, oh, could go a bit higher. I'm running a bit cold still. So all I've been doing this mission is messing with these. Uh, so we'll close this radiator a bit. Close it all a little bit. I wish there was a gauge to know how much I've closed it. Yeah, Flo's is looking pretty quiet. As are uh, my wingmen. Oh, they are back there. Okay. Uh, one thing I forgot to do is turn the the buzzer on. That alerts me when the planes are in the army. Um, Alright, so the next leg was to Argentum, which uh, I know very well. It's got the airfields. Don't you see some flak shooting up at me? No. Somebody caught my eye then, but uh, so we're 092. Alright, two's got some targets, nine o'clock. Go get them, two. Alright, where are you, three? It's infield two behind me. I don't know where three is. trouble in the last campaign. Every time they went to bomb something, I never knew where they bloody well were. Which makes me a bad leader, because I should always know where my wing are, but... Um, alright, so... Shit. Oh, there we go. Something's been hit down there. Whoa! Is that my flight? They didn't tell me they're engaging. Is that a train? Are they attacking a the train? I want a piece of that. Let's see if there's any more ground targets down there. Let's go.
It shows how good my eyes are. I didn't see a damn thing when I was looking. I think there's still one up there. Come on, I'm still trimming too far right. Me, I think that was someone else that nabbed that one. Yeah, I've got to watch my slip meter down there when I run in, but yeah, there was a train that we hit in. <laughs> All right, uh, now I'm way out of trim now. All right, so. But it's just pulling me left. Something horrid. Keep right. Let's get this slip meter where it should be. Level flight. Get the speed up. Okay, that's trimmed out there. So as long as I'm going in at this. I guess the best thing to do is get the right speed, trim out, and then go in for your bottom run. <laughs> There's my wing. Unless I know the little bell works. Alright, let's get some height again. Yeah, I've got the whole lot with me. Alright, they're all done. So make sure they're rejoined. Join up. And now we head to Argentum, which was 092. I shall come back uh, when I'm at the next waypoint. Alright, welcome back. Uh, I'm off to my 1 o'clock, oh sorry, 11 o'clock. I've got the town of Argentin. Um, the airfield at the front, which let's have a look if it's manned. So we don't see any plane activity down there. Um, so that's abandoned by the look of it, or... Yeah, I'm not sure, I didn't see any planes at that field with the whole uh, campaign last time, so... I'm not expecting much. Uh, flak at Argentin, I am expecting. But haven't received yet, and I'm a bit too low, I've got to get above 10,000. Uh, let's see the wind wing spark up for anything around here. There's the railway line. There's the second airfield. Everyone's going home. I did check this too. Look at the fuel. I'm literally just under half. And a full one on the right tank so this thing I think holds a heck of a lot spit I'd be um, heading back to base by now I uh, can't see anything down there but it doesn't mean there's not ah train a train a train let's do it let's do it Let's see if we can hit it before it did. So let's trim out. And about there when I'm running in. Okay. Let's do it. Now they were attacking another train there. They don't seem to go for these ones that are just moving along, so I'm not sure what the thing with uh, trains is when you're meant to attack them and when not. Let's 
Central. There's the guys from um, England. So they're saying they've cut four lines in the rail. Which means uh, they just stopped all the uh, rail activity, I guess. Or slowed it down. Alright, let's do one more run. Steady, 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 steady. <laughs> Target fixation. Uh, bugger, it's hard to get trains. I thought I got some hits on it, but... Uh, I'm just going for another one, because I've got no flak and I'm liking this. <laughs> Gonna go under the bridge. Oh, I got some good hits on it then. And nothing destroyed. Oh, hang on, he's got a target. Uh, go for it. Two, three. Gage. Oh, he stopped. Stopped him. Oh, where are you? I'm going to make sure they're on my wing before I call them out to attack because I lose them straight away. Yep, there's one. Going that way. Still seeing. Hopefully, that's the one going in for attack. Don't. Okay, he's, he's running in. Excellent. I'll watch him go all the way in. Yes! Finally seen them. Maybe they're tracking the train. Oh, this is cool. First time I've actually followed him in. Oh, I see where they're going. Ah, oh, you little buggers. You just killed everything in one go. Ah, it was a sitting duck target too. Oh, just... Oh. Well, I guess I could still take this train out, but I'm not going to get really paid for it. Another train coming in from that way. Oh, there's trains galore. So that was like a... Actually there's a train... Oh there's a train right there. Let's go in. Probably don't collide with me wingman. Okay, there it is. And squeeze. Oop. Okay, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Oh. Okay. That was a bit aggressive, but I hit something and I'm happy. I did not even see them sitting there. Alright, I'll let them clean that up. Oh, this is cool. This is a very good first mission. That train is about to come in, so I'm going to try to hit this train. Four, gun, gun. Three, going gun, in. Gun. So that's that one down. Well, they didn't say target destroyed, did they? Let's just try hit this. Okay, I finally hit him. Oh, I got the locomotive. 
I am liking this. How's my temps? Temps are spot on. Ah, this has been a very productive. Ah, terrific. Uh, looks like they're coming back to me, are they? Or is that my other flight? So I'm going to try to take out this other train, but... Uh, I'll let it, I want to see if it actually, what it actually does when it gets to these. So there's literally one, two, three, four, about another seven trains up there. Let's see if they straight through it. Yep. <laughs> Alright, um, next leg is up to Brunei, 046 for 32, so I'm just going to get squared away on that, and yeah, that's pretty cool. So it looks like there's trains that you, are valid targets and just general trains. What did I say? 46. Just get my wingman to form back up, and yeah, I'll come back uh, when I'm at Bernay, or if something happens. All right, welcome back. Um, I do believe this town here, the railway going through it, is Bernay. Yeah, you can see the dotted line, I'm pretty sure, is the railway. So, and that leads back to the so... So let's just have a quick look down there, see if there's any targets. A couple of trains, but I'm not going to shoot every train on this map. Oh. Not last long. Um, let's see if the wingman see anything. See any think of value down there? Do one circle, no flak. So kind of one plane down over there. That's in I um, mean Colt 2. That might be Colt 2 catching up. I've got one two yeah, okay, I'll get on my flight. So let's just come back around and then we'll head back to base, I think. No, I can't see anything. Alright, so Lasso is there in the middle of the screen. She usually has a lot of flax, so I'm going to stay to the north side of that. Shouldn't be dropping so much height on my 8000 now. Um, yeah, so the so's over there, which puts me... Um, just going to about up here. And then I'll just head back to Carburg. Alright, and hopefully land this thing. And that will be one happy fella. I'm uh, getting pretty confident now with... Oh, actually, I've just noticed. <laughs> to fly this whole time with that uncage. Or cage. <laughs> um, uh, what was I saying? Yes. Um, oh, now it's gone down again. Good grief, I can't get this temperature right. I put on auto, it just overheats it. Oh, it's a little low too. Let me just try that back on automatic. 
I still haven't had any air targets. And that's the Havre off to my one o'clock. So yeah, I think I'll just come over just or so there. Come a bit north and then head over the coast, back over the water, back to base. Alright, um, I shall continue and you'll probably see me, hopefully, when I'm coming in to land. Oh. Oh. That's not good. My temps are too cold. That's not good at all. Uh, where's the lines? I've got to get back over Carburg. There's Carburg there. Oh boy. Something's happened to my engine. I was up higher, so maybe... I wasn't that high though. Oh yeah, I was up at 12,000, so maybe I was pushing that engine too high at that height. I did notice my manifold was a lot lower. Uh, I don't know if my engine's fully dead or what, but it was doing weird things, so I'm just going to ease it back. Yeah, it's got me a bit worried. Alright. Let's just get over the front lines and then worry about it. Ah, oh, don't muck up now. Don't muck up now. Can I see on the outside view? No smoke or anything. Maybe I just was too high pushing it too hard and there's Carburg below me now so it looks like I'll get back over front lines. Uh, there's St. Croix, my old base and my base is... my base is... St. Croix is... let's trim out a bit. Alright, St. Croix is this one, which is the base that runs here. And there's one there, which is this one. So I think my one's this one on the left. It's a long way away right now. <laughs> but we'll keep pushing. My, sp oh no, my speed's dropping pretty bad. I don't have to push the push the manifold. No, manifold's not doing anything. Alright, I'm going to have to put it down again. Uh, is there a base near me? I'm not going to make that one either. You bugger. You absolute bugger. Beach. Guys, just head back to base. Just head back to base. Flight RTB. Crew, copy. Crew, RTB. Pull to RTB. See ya, lads. Hold me a beer. Yeah, I reckon, oh, uh, that airfield, nah, uh, I'm only doing 150. Yeah, I reckon, uh, the beach is the go. That looks a bit on a hill, doesn't it? Uh, 
I'm just not gonna I'm just not gonna make that airfield, I know it. Maybe just that grass bit there I can do. Alright. Something. I got something, but there's just so many trees there. I'm getting a bit of I'm getting a bit of power back actually. No. No. No, nah, let's put it down. Okay, let's go gear. Flaps. Oh, coming in too fast now. Bleed off, bleed off, bleed off, bleed off. Bleed off. Oh, this is running out of room. Be faster than 100. Come on, bleed off speed. So on this grass strip is my plan. Come on, bleed off speed. Oh, it's up. Oh, no, I'll put it on the. Oh, oh no. Oh, it's not going well. It's not going well. Keep it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Don't flip, don't flip, don't flip. Eject, eject. Alright. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> oh my god. That is... Oh, see, I'm fine. It's all good. That is no problems. That is safe. I am going back to base, and that is not a death. <laughs> All right, there's a road right next to me. I'll get uh, having a bit of barbecue. But that's okay. Oh, looks like the fire's going out. I'm still standing. All the noise, anyway. Anyway, so that's the campaign <laughs> mission one. Uh, actually, that was a lot. Yeah, it's very deceptive when you're up there. I should have just went for the... That was flat up where I was. That's probably why it was pushing me off centre. That, in fact, I'm on grass, but anyway. Um, all good. Let's have a look at the scorecard. 51 out of 283 vehicles. That's not too bad at all. We lost one plane. My score was 40, which is very good. I'm happy I got something. Although it doesn't tell me I got anything. That's a bit mean. <laughs> anyway, I got 40 points and 100 results, so that'll do me. Um, yeah, that is mission uh, one of the Shanwood campaign and we'll see how far I get. I'd have to look up what's going on with my engines because this is a lot trickier to work than the Spitfire the engine by the look of it. If anyone's got any tips on the Mustang let me know. And I shall leave it there.